So welcome to our November market wrap. We're coming to you today from number 23A Dickman Street, Richmond Hill, with the world's best view off the terrace here. Three bedroom townhouse. These are doing really well at the moment, James. Want to say best luck to our vendors, Matt and Lou. So James, just fresh out of October, a huge month for the office. Can you tell us about that? I can. Look, Biggin and Scott as a team, we did close to 50 sales, which was phenomenal. I think for the month of uh, November, already booked in as well as well over 40. And into December, of course, we've got auctions booked second, ninth, and 16th. So there's still opportunity opportunity there for buyers. 16th of December, our last auction weekend for the year. So there's a couple of good ones coming up. Keep an eye out for those. So James, if buyers do miss out for the last weekend of the year, can you tell us about some opportunities over summer? So traditionally, we've had a lot of vendors contact us wanting to sell, but not necessarily wanting to get onto the market. So um, I guess our approach is um, a soft summer launch, approaching each buy on our database. So forthcoming auction campaign? Yep, exactly right. Um, and basically putting it to them off market prior to potentially launching in that January, February period. And, and January as a private sale forthcoming process, we'd be selling, what, 15 to 20 properties traditionally? Look, probably about 15 to 20, which uh, means there's lots of uh, opportunity for the buyers then. And James, what about some key auction dates for February 2018? Look, Feb's uh, going to be obviously the first month that we uh, traditionally do auction. The 10th, uh, which is going to be the first uh, auction weekend for the year. Uh, the 17th, followed by the 24th. Um, which means if you want to be ready for the 10th of Feb, uh, photos on the 9th of January. So James, can you tell us about a couple of key sales for October? Yep, so your favourite block, 19 at 84 Trenary Crescent. We did set a new record, fantastic effort, 830,000 for a two bed townhouse. So previous sale was a year ago for 760 and then just got 8.30 on the weekends. Ed, tell us a bit about River Street. So Andrew Crotty did an amazing auction at 35 River Street and uh, got a price over 1.5 for a townhouse there. We had 37 coming up, but uh, quietly introduced it to the underbid of that auction. Uh, slightly smaller floor plan, but ended up selling that in excess of 1.3 uh, pre-market. And James, a townhouse in Cutter Street, uh, some amazing success there. Tell us about that. Look, Ben uh, in our team actually had a fantastic result there. Um, so full credit to, uh, to Ben. Another agent had that on the market for roughly about four months. Unfortunately, for whatever reason, couldn't sell. Uh, we managed to pick it up uh, and in only four days managed to get the full asking price for our wonderful vendor tree there. So Ed, we've always got some fantastic listings coming up. Uh, any notable ones? We do. We've got a rock star penthouse back at Trenary Crescent Abbotsford. This overlooks Victoria Park, top floor. It's a developer's own. It's incredible. It's got four bedrooms, three bathrooms, three car spaces. It's got a spa on the terrace, outdoor kitchen. Goes to auction on the 9th of December. Call now if you want further details. So from 23A Dickman Street, the world's best terrace viewers, thanks for watching, James. Thanks for being on the video. It's always a pleasure. And we'll see you next month. So traditionally, we've had a lot of vendors contact us. Uh, sorry. Uh, number 19, we got a Shh. We are filming. We'd be selling, what, 15 to 20 properties traditionally? Yeah. Sorry. Later. <laughs> I'm trying to help out there. <laughs>